This is the news leader, Channel 7 Eyewitness News, first at 4. And I'm Dr. Septa Parikh. It's Melanoma Monday, a reminder that skin cancer is the most common cancer. Coming up, you'll see a new device doctors are using to diagnose it. Well, even though we have heard the warnings for years, melanoma cases are still very much on the rise. But doctors now have a better tool to diagnose a disease. Dr. Stupin Preek here to tell us more about it. Doctor. Well, today is Melanoma Monday, which is why I'm wearing orange. It's a day of awareness. But I want to show you a few pictures here first. Proof that skin cancer can look really different in different people. So that one's melanoma. But all three are actually skin cancer. Even this one that doesn't really look that bad. It's proof that you can't tell just by looking at it. And that's why it is so important to get checked out. When you're in your 20s or your teens, you kind of feel invincible. But last fall, Andrea Seglowski was diagnosed with melanoma on her right calf. She's an actress, and it was a fellow actor who noticed the mole. And said, I, you know, I have a friend who had something that looked like that, and um, he died, so you should maybe go have that checked out. Andrea's cancer was caught early, but melanoma kills one American every hour. It's the most common cancer among people between the ages of 25 and 29, and it's often diagnosed later in men. In fact, the death rates are more in men, and the type of melanomas that present with they are usually a little bit more invasive. And part of that because men are not as good as going to the doctor. Dr. Human Khorasani is co-founder of the Melanoma Institute at Mount Sinai Hospital. He says the number of melanoma cases keeps going up and the use of tanning beds, the thinning ozone layer, and not wearing sunscreen are all part of the problem. But melanoma can happen to anyone of any color, even in places where the sun never shines. They usually present under the nail beds or um, on foot. Um, usually in the sole of your foot. There is new technology making it easier for doctors to diagnose. The borders are very regular. That device works with the iPhone retina display. Andrea says she noticed that mole on her leg had been changing last summer and ignored it at first, but hopes you will not do the same. It's worth it to get checked out. And I know not everyone has a dermatologist, but there are free screenings being offered all month long by some great dermatologists. We have posted the link for more information at 7 online. Just click on Health News. And you can also find the info on my Twitter page at Dr. Supna, ABC7. And listen, David, I just had my skin check last week. There's nothing fun about being looked over by a mic with a microscope, but it's right. so important. It's so important. And, you know, our own Michelle Charlesworth has raised awareness on mm -hmm. this very issue. With her battle, she did so well with it, and hopefully everybody listens to this report. Yep. Gets checked out. Go get checked it's out. It's a scary thing. Thanks, Thanks so Upna. Much.